All right, it's official. I am obsessed. So I just spent a ton of time. Andrew helped me, um, but we just punched and like cut all of these uh, little tags and punched them out. And I made a bunch of buttons. So I've got some, hold on, let me overthink about it in a few different colors. Uh, so much cute stuff. So we have so many cute ones. I've got the plant lady one and let's get lost. We've got stay weird. Uh, kind people are my kind people. Small business owner. Hold on, let me overthink about it. Literally dead. There's just so many cute ones and they look freaking adorable on here. Like seriously, look at them. They look so cute. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. <laughs> um, yeah, we got lots of different colors and stuff. I'm really excited about this. I can't wait to take pictures and get them listed and whatever, but yeah, I don't know. I'm excited. I also made some pronoun ones, uh, like she, her. I have some other ones, but I accidentally made them upside down. So there's that. <laughs> but yeah, I'm excited. Ooh! Okay, I had to make a trip to Michael's because I ran out of envelopes, unfortunately. So these cards I had previously made but didn't have envelopes for. So I went to Michael's and I got envelopes so that I can package those up for the craft show. I also got some heat transfer vinyl. I'm not sure if I already had black heat transfer, like just plain black, not glitter. So I'll have to check and see if I already had some or not, but I got that for these canvas tote bags or sorry cotton they're cotton tote bags um so benton is here <laughs> um anyway so that's what i got i did also my goodness i also got some extra white cardstock because i was running low after putting all the inserts like in my cards and stuff last night um and then another pack of envelopes that's that so i got our transfer i also got um, a couple of just sheets of vinyl. Um, this was actually more cost effective for me than getting entire rolls of vinyl, which I don't need. Like I only need a little bit of each color, so this was great. I have a cute french fry design that I'm gonna use on some of the little keychains. So I wanted the yellow and the, or, um, the red for that. And yeah, I don't know, I'm excited. Red is cherry smoothie. Cherry smoothie. 
Also, completely unrelated, however, if you're a video game nerd like I am, um, you'll appreciate this. I got a pack of Animal Crossing Amiibo cards with this is a Hello Kitty. It's the Sanrio version. Anyway, these were really hard to get a few months ago when they first came out, and now my Target finally had them in stock. So I picked up a pack, but the ones I was actually looking for were the new ones, which, of course, they didn't have. So anyway, if you're an Animal Crossing uh, nerd like I am, super cute. Target had them. Yay! <laughs> different. That's very different.
Okay, I am pairing up all the colors of my tassels with the vinyl so I can see which colors look good together and then that way I can pick which designs to put on each one because I was getting frustrated trying to do like one design at a time and like having to go back and cut and then do all the steps and it was just taking a very long time. So I'm hoping this will kind of streamline things a little bit. Uh, I'm really excited. I think I've got like maybe 30 more that I can make and then they'll be all gone. <laughs> Okay, the kids are playing outside, so if you hear anything, that's what it is. <laughs> but we just brought up these side panel things that go to this like spinning unit that I bought forever ago from a Joanne that was going out of like out of business. I think they were moving; they weren't really going out of business. Anyway, I bought this like spinning display rack that they use for buttons for relatively cheap, and I'm thinking about trying to use this for the craft show so that I can put all my new products like these little guys the keychains and stuff on little hangers we bought little hangers for the back of those that should be here today so then I can kind of hang them up like two and two and the buttons can go on here too they need to be cleaned up they've been in the garage so they're a little dirty but I'm gonna start laying stuff out and see kind of how it looks and how I feel about it and then we'll go from there all right, we just got the package for the little tab things that I mentioned before. So these will go on the back of the keychains so that I can hang them. Uh, so we'll go ahead and test one out here in just a sec and I'll see how they work. Okay, so I just loaded a few of the products on. I think it looks really cool. I don't know, you guys tell me what you think. So this goes on a spinning rack like I mentioned before, but so now I've got my little buttons. I use the hang tags to hang up my little keychains. Um, that's just a little bit of them. So I've got the front and back of this um, and I think it looks so cute. So I'm gonna kind of like put on my products and see what I think and I think this is gonna work. Hey, uh, it's time to end the studio vlog. This is actually Monday, Jess, from, from next week. I'm starting a new studio vlog now, but I have not been able to edit the one from last week. I'm not even sure what kind of content there is, to be honest. It, the week was so busy and I didn't film nearly as much as I wanted to, so I apologize in advance if there's not anything like super entertaining in this video that you just watched. I'll try my best. <laughs> Hopefully this week will be better. I'm still super busy, but at least the craft show is over. It went really well. Um, it went better than I thought it was going to. So I'm really, really excited about that. Um, we've got finally, well, you can't tell, but there's some beautiful fall colors outside. I've got a cozy sweater on. Um, so yeah, I'm just, I'm ready to start a new week. It's Monday, so I'm getting started on that stuff. I gotta edit this video and get it posted for you all. Uh, thanks for hanging out with me. I love you and I'll see you next week. Bye.